The K-239 Chunmu is a South Korean artillery rocket system, also known as KMLRS. Development commenced in 2009. Rockets were developed by Hanwha Corporation and the launcher vehicle was developed by Doosan DST. South Korean MOD planned to order a first batch of 58 Chunmu systems to replace the USM-270 MLRS. In the near future it might replace the older K-136 Koryong. In 2022 Poland completed negotiations with South Korea to acquire 288 launchers with 23,000 rockets and production license for the rockets. In concept the Chunmu is similar to the USM-270 MLRS artillery rocket system. Republic of Korea Army currently operates a total of 58 M270 systems. However the new Chunmu is based on wheel chassis rather than tracked. The Chunmu also lacks launching rails. Rockets are launched from interchangeable modular containers. Rockets are factory fitted and sealed in containers and can be stored without any maintenance for a number of years. Vehicle carries two of these containers. The Chunmu is a multi-caliber rocket system. These rockets can be fired from the same platform but have different ranges. The system will use 130 mm, 227 mm, and 230 mm rockets. A standard 130 mm rocket is 2.4 m long and weights 55 kg. It has a maximum range of 23 km. Extended range rockets can reach 36 km. Other sources claim that newly developed rockets have a maximum range is 80 km. These artillery rockets are used by the current K-136 Koryong. A standard 227 mm rocket is 3.96 m long and weights 296 kg. It has a maximum range of 45 km. These rockets are used by USM-270 MLRS and M142 MRs. A standard 230 mm rocket is 3.96 m long. It has a maximum range of 80 km. Other sources claim that these rockets have a range of 160 km. Both guided and unguided rockets are available. Warheads include HEFRAG, incendiary, smoke, illumination, cargo warheads with anti-tank or pre-fragmented anti-personnel submunitions. Furthermore vehicle can carry a combination of any two rocket pods. The main role of the Chunmu is to suppress North Korean artillery systems in case of a military conflict. It is worth noting that North Korea has an enormous artillery force. The Chunmu can destroy fortifications, bridges, runways and concentrations of troops and vehicles. One launcher with a full salvo covers an area the size of three football fields. Recently a new short-range ballistic missile was developed for this system. It was inspired by the US Atoms and should have broadly similar performance. The launcher vehicle has an armored cab, which provides protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. This artillery rocket system has a fast reaction time and can launch its rockets within several minutes from traveling. A full salvo can be launched directly from the cab or remotely from the vehicle. Wheeled vehicles are cheaper to obtain, to operate, and to maintain. Also it can briefly self-deploy over long distances. Due to these reasons a wheeled chassis was selected. However wheeled vehicles lack cross-country mobility of track machines. Each Chunmu launcher vehicle is planned to be escorted by associated transport vehicle, which carries two sets of reload rockets and is fitted with a crane. Transport vehicle is planned to be based on a similar 8x8 high-mobility vehicle. The Chunmu launcher has an integrated crane. Reloading is made by the crew within 10 minutes. Polish Chunmu launchers are planned to be based on a locally produced Jelks military truck with 8x8 configuration. These artillery rocket systems will also use Polish Topaz battlefield management system. In 2022 Poland completed negotiations with South Korea to acquire a total of 288 launchers with 23,000 rockets and production license for the rockets.